going on, guys? It's Larry Wheels here with Steve Gentili. What up? Flying out from Indianapolis. And then we have Black Tom Cruise, you already know. Wow. And I'm really excited because today I'm going to go head to head with this guy with the 225 pound dumbbells. And this has only been done like a few times according to YouTube and Instagram history. And I'm just really pumped. I want to go right to it. So let's do it. 20 reps with 150 something climbing stuff. Just a few weeks ago, right? Yeah, a couple weeks, man. That's cardio though, man. It's a lot different than the heavy stuff. The poor guy, the poor guy can't go any heavier because his gym doesn't have heavier dumbbells, so this must be a treat for you right now. Yeah, I had, <laughs> had to fly all the way out here to hit some heavy stuff. <laughs> Indianapolis needs some heavier weights. Oh, yes. Come on, Larry. Go ahead. All right. Oh, yeah. What's the way that? We, we warm it up with. What's the next way you want to warm up? Yeah, well, I don't know. You guys are dictating the workout. Right? Well, we just warm the 60s, 120. I'm not doing 120, I'm doing 100. Yeah, I'm going to do 100 too, man. I'm old, man. I got to take yeah. it. <laughs> I'm not old, I'm 23. <laughs> Come on, give me this guy. Nice. Oh, yes. Nice. Oh. Wow. What happened, Jim? Gentlemen yeah. with the weights for now. <laughs> this shout out to uh, Stoyak gear. He got the belt on, the sleeves, the red. He ain't even over got, 100 pounds I, yet. Yeah, I, got, I, <laughs> I gotta look like I'm 275, man. Oh. I'm on that Leaf Fit journey. Let's go. Bower. Okay. Wait, are you going 125? You're taking your time, man. Jesus. Huh? How many sets are you going to do before 225? <laughs> don't worry about the don't worry about the warm up. Worry about the end result. Right, yeah. He's got his old guys, man. 33 and 36. <laughs> I look 25 though. I don't even I look 25 though. <laughs> we go 120 is the 175? Yeah. Well, yeah. Then I'm gonna go 225. Oh, this is your last one? Yeah. What you want first? Uh do the left one first. Left one first? Yeah. Let me know you're ready. Right. Ready? So come on. Come on. Yep. Got it. Yep. Come on, Larry. Yep. Oh! Come on, Larry. Oh yeah. Hey, I lift alone. Oh, I'm using those too, man. <laughs> See the mental games they're playing. He let me get all the way to the rack before shooting. <laughs> Yep, I had to, it's teamwork, man. <laughs> I don't want to help with this, Neva. Oh, okay. If he could do it, I want to do it. Hey, that's, that's years of practice for me, man. That's years of practice. Don't, uh, don't hurt yourself. I'm going to take that as a challenge. Yeah. <laughs> Power! Yeah, I mean, yeah. You like it? I've jumped from 500 bench to 630. Was that at Zoo? No, that was at um Mount Vernon. No shit. 500 to 630, man. I like taking big jumps. Damn. I feel like the set in between, I can take a lot of energy. Yeah, you know what, man? It's like I've missed a lot of six, third attempts, and it's because I think I get, I think I too hard myself. on the second. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Like, cause I go for that small PR, and then I go for what the number I want. But everyone tells me next time around, like, for six, I'm going to take it on the second next time. Yeah. Like, just take it on the second. I do it that way, too. For sure. Yeah. Ten years younger, you're still learning. <laughs> still, still out here dropping knowledge. <laughs> oh, yeah. 
Yeah, no, yeah. Oh, I'm uh, you want 175 next? Yeah. yeah. Okay, I'm uh, I'm gonna do my 225 set now. Oh yeah, yeah. No, don't let me fuck you. Up. Yeah, unless you want to go first. Oh good, I can I can invest. No, whatever you want to do, man. All right, you ready? I'm ready to do this shit. All right. He does more than five. I'm faking Andrew. <laughs> you want me, you want one at the same time, or you want him to do it just like you did? Definitely both at the same time. Right. The less time it's sitting on my leg, the better. Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna help him with the first with the first rep. I'm gonna help him get in that groove for the first rep. I'm gonna do the same for you. Uh, yeah. It's such a bad position to be in there, so the first first rep, I'll let like you get the momentum and I'll leave you alone after. Alright. Yeah. Those same playing field, you know? Yeah. Alright. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, do it like this, man. Let him let him know that it's Oh, wow. Oh, whoa. Oh, that's something new. What the hell? That's something new. <laughs> All right, I'm not trying to do that. That's a new concept. What the hell? Wait, the weight's big enough. Bam. They should have had a seat. No, please don't. Please don't try to do that. All right. <laughs> I do it the regular way. Well, you got like 10 pounds on a fire wire. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think so. <laughs> You're too top heavy. <laughs> <laughs> too top heavy. <laughs> there is. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Come on, man. You gotta be daddy on this Yeah. Come on, Larry. Come on, Larry. Come on, you now? Yeah, yeah. Come on, Larry. Yeah. Good? Yeah. Uh, Come on, Larry. Come on, Larry. Let's get it. Are you doing um, some money for 225 also or no? I mean, you keep it around. <laughs> All right. Seems to work out well for him. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. When you're ready, when you're ready. Oh, go ahead. Oh! Let's go, Steve. Come on! Nice. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Too easy. Man. Jesus. Jim oh, Eddick yeah. is gone. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. I guess it's a jungle now, huh? <laughs> wow. That's a big power. That's a big power. Uh, yeah, 140s. Do the 140s. Hold on. Hold on for one second. Let me snip this shit. Oh, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Oh, 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 yeah. Power, come on! Hey, come on! Well, yep. Let's go! Good! Easy, come on! Yes, sir! Nice! More! More! Nice! More! Yes! There it is! Lock up! Oh. Yes, come on! Okay. Oh. Alright, oh. nice! Oh, yes! Oh. Alright, you know, they got some baby I can rub on the handles for you. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see, man. Alright, get it, man. What's up? Same time? Let's go. Power! Let's go! Let's go. Come on, Come on, Steve. Let's get it, Steve. Come on, Steve. Let's see it. Push, Steve! Yes! Come on! Bring him out, Steve! Come on, Steve! Oh, yeah! yeah. Oh, oh, shit! Yeah. Bring him out! Bring him out! You have more! You have more! Oh, Steve! Shit! Bring him out! Oh, Bring shit! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Shit, man. That's good shit, man. Eh? It's all right. It's good shit, man. You know, I saw it like you were kind of, like it was tilting a little bit. <laughs> Yeah, it's duty when you're not used to it, it's just fucking different ball game. You know what? Yeah. It's a little tighter, I think we've done a little bit. 
Yeah. I have an unfair advantage. I actually did these once before. This is the first time. <laughs> <laughs> and I ain't too mad at it. <laughs> How do you feel, though? Oh, awkward. It really looked awkward. like it was like it was your, your wrist was tough. Yeah, you, yeah, I mean, you're just heavy, dude. Yeah. Not used to it, and it's just uh, fucking heavy. <laughs> Not much to say. Just how was it compared to the two fifteen? Like a big difference, you think, or? I mean, you got to remember. So the two fifteen was like I was coming off of a meat prep. I was peaked. Okay. So like, this is me. You know, I, I haven't really been lifting too heavy, but it's. Uh, you know, just like you, you don't random it, going in the gym try to hit six plates, <laughs> it's not gonna go well unless you've trained for it. True. Very true. I mean, still, you got it up, man. That's that's impressive, man. Yeah. Out of nowhere, you know. Exactly. Yeah, that's true. My first time, my first goal, you only got three, three, and it was like almost half reps. <laughs> so this is this is big. Yeah. But well, we got we got those two fifties up. I mean, I'm gonna just keep working with them. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. That's a. Yeah, that's gonna be a rocky road. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> for sure. It's gonna be a rocky road. Especially if like you seen the difference between this and two hundreds, it's a big difference. It's it's huge. It's a big difference. A lot of people don't realize that. No, I know, because you think twenty five pounds is not gonna make a big difference, but Well, yeah, twenty five pounds each arm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It'd be like fifty pounds. So a fifty pound jump, yeah, that's true. That's yeah, true. You know, that'd be perfect timing. Well, how many when's your show? November, mid November. Oh so, yeah, so you get a couple weeks to rebound. Yeah, yeah. That'd be perfect. Great, so you can beat me twice. <laughs> I was hoping I could get him like a week after the show. Completed. Joe Casabate is boss. Oh yeah. Oh. Come on, Larry. Oh. We use the plan. Casabate use the final. Oh. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, Larry. They're using them higher. They're using bark. Come on, Larry. Let's go. Come on. Oh, nice. Oh, God. Nice. Full stack to it, Dad. That was higher than 225. <laughs> Full iron stack. Oh, look at that. Yeah, that's what he saved it for. Oh, yeah, see? <laughs> look at that. Yeah. Stacking it up. Jeez. These look like 35s, but they're really 45s. Just making sure you guys know. <laughs> Ed built this up for you, too? Yeah, Ed's doing it right now. Yeah. All right. <laughs> I would have had him spot me. That would have been all right. Nice. Touch my chest if you fucking paid me. I have to lean on the I bar. I was seriously trying. Really? I tried. Wow. I tried. Shit. Especially if you take a conservative squat. No, I'm going for a PR squat. Oh, well. We're going for a PR squat too? Eight, six, and eight, man. Those are my goals. I like, I, I right. Say no more? All right. Yeah. All right. Count for blood. Yeah, right. for sure. You, man. Well, at that, after you, you're going, 800 is going to be conservative anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hopefully. Yeah. Squats, squats and deads are feeling good, man. Bench, like, you know, losing 30 pounds yeah. definitely took a dip. But it'll be it'll be back by the time I need it to be. You're up to 304, now you're down to 278? Uh, I was at 304. I got down to 270. Now 270. I'm back up to 278. So my strength is rebounded some. I thought, I, was on, I thought I was on Lean Fitness Journey, but I guess. <laughs> oh, you didn't see my before and after? Mm -hmm. Nah, man. Ooh. I got to go. Yeah, let me show you something. <laughs> oh, yeah. Three, right? Yeah. Oh, get it. <laughs> oh, power. Oh. Good. Oh. Yo, Larry. Oh. Oh yes. Oh. 
Just a reminder, these are 35s. Oh shit, this guy's a hater. This guy's a hater, Jesus. Change them out. I'm gonna have to edit that. Edit that part of the video. Let's go. Come on! Nice. Balls at the bottom. Nice. Easy work, Otis. Yes, sir. Good try. Drop. Nice. Three more. Good try. Boy! There it is. Come on, Otis. Goddamn. I gotta apply social security. <laughs> Jesus. Can't be doing this for too long. I'm a bomber carry cutting it. <laughs> On three. Yeah. Two. Oh. Power. Oh. Nice. Nice. I like I just don't. Sheesh. Sheesh. Oh. Excuse me. <laughs> Lift? Yeah. Oh, come on. Come on, push. Let's go. Oh, yes. Nice. Nice. Chest is making a mad face right now. Come on. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Nice. So you think that was 325 just now, probably? I mean, 315, you know. 315. For, for you, there was... 325, man. I for me, like 345. 350, easy. <laughs> Come on, Steve, let's get it. Big power. Come on. Steve. Attack, Steve. Two. Oh. Oh, Steve. Oh, oh. Yes. God damn. Crank him up. Let's go. Crank him. Tighter! Tighter! Four! Oh shit! Three more! Monster! Yes! Ah. Two more! Good. Oh! Yes! One more! Yes! Come on! Finish it! Finish it! Okay. 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 Oh yeah. It's making me work today, man! <laughs> <laughs> So you got some gist on that tape, man. <laughs> I was just sending out an SOS on that last one. <laughs> Start browning out. <laughs> hey, go, just touch and go on these, though. Yeah, touch and go. Don't do that pause shit. Okay. What, so what was your last set, six? Yeah, six. All right, I'm just, just six. so you know. All I'm saying is even if he gets 10, he's still 5'11", so. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Short guy got short range of motion. Jesus Christ. <laughs> when, Let's go. When oh, Olympic shoes and shit. <laughs> you gotta be six, man. Let's go. Yeah, make me look down. Come on. <laughs> Power. Let's go, Rob. Get up. Nice. There it is. Good there, boy. Tighter. Come on. Boy. This boy. Shh. You gotta get another one. Fuck, that's it. Damn. I heard that elbow. Damn, that elbow I cracked. I heard it, I heard it. Damn it. Oh, pop. Hey, you matched it, though. Huh? You matched that, so. Yeah. Fuck, man. Jeez, my name's the Black Tom Blast in about 10 <laughs> weeks, so yeah. Black on Blast, Yep, man. yep. <laughs> so what do you think the biggest transition has been going from powerlifting into a bodybuilding program? I would say, I can't say one thing, but two things. Frequency of training, powerlifting, I'm going maybe twice a week. And then every other week I'm taking a week off just to recover from the heavy squats, benches, and delts. Bodybuilding, I gotta go at least five days a week. Um, the rest periods are much different. I could spend 20 minutes uh, resting for a certain power thing, but in bodybuilding, I should yeah. be resting on two minutes. So yeah. there's a big difference in how you train. Also, diet, like you can't afford to skip meals for bodybuilding. That's everything if, if you're trying to lose or gain. And you have to be so much more strict with the diet and bodybuilding. Right. Like, so much more strict. And I would say, you know what? If I had to pick between the training and diet, the diet's definitely the biggest difference. Because probably you can get away eating whatever you want and still put up a big total. You know, you still get right. strong eating pizza, Dunkin' Donuts, whatever you want. But bodybuilding, you're not gonna win a show eating whatever you want. Right. You know, so I would say diet's the biggest difference. Cause I can still lift heavy bodybuilding prep. I should make some reps for y'all to get better and strong at reps. <clears throat> I just don't, kind of, you get better at where you practice that, you know? So you feel like when you're going from bodybuilding back into powerlifting, all that extra volume has helped you, the conditioning has helped you? Yeah, the biggest thing that helps me with transitioning back and forth between the two is 
when you go for singles and triples, you put a lot of stress on your joints yeah. and your body overall. And you can only afford maybe, you know, a couple of one rep max deadlifts and squats and benches a year. I mean, for longevity, I want to be in it for at least 10 more years. I'm only 23, but doing three, four meets a year, I can see something out of the game like a year or two just because yeah. of injuries and stuff like that. So helps you time it out more. Yeah, I get so much more time to recover between meets doing bodybuilding prep. Focus on other goals. Yeah, for longevity, I think it's the best way to do it. Bodybuilding, then power thing, and just all same between the two. I think you get people get far than low. Hey, Dodge kind of works. Hey, but he didn't even make it to the he didn't even make it to the to the cheese game. <laughs> I, like, I got to look up for footage tomorrow. For what? I got to look up for the footage today. Oh yeah, that's right. You spent a lot more time right away exactly focusing on the pump uh the start of the workout i get off the strength movements for instagram and youtube and then 90 percent of the workout is this just getting a pump i don't really care how much i'm lifting you know a lot less, a lot over time a lot less stress on my body yeah it's pretty much exactly like when i've gotten older that's what i trying to just do this like i used to do a lot more like heavier movements everything max now it's like two or three heavy compound motions then I do a lot of the a lot of the fluff work after that. <laughs> fluff work, that's yeah. a good word for it. <laughs> <laughs> Like if, if you're not doing enough, you're not going to have the right response to the adaptations that you want, which in this case, hypertrophy, right? So it's like you need to match the intensity with the overall workload for the specific goal. Yeah, but it's not going to help you deadlift this shit done for sure. I mean, it seems to be working all right for this guy. <laughs> <laughs> it's doing okay. Go always do better, right? Yeah. Go always do better. Steve, what's your best accessory for the for the bench? What's your, your money accessory for the bench? Uh, I think the heavy dumbbell work, man. I think it transitions a lot. Um, also, most people miss uh, the, the tricep work. So, like, close grip benching. Um, Spoto pressing where you're pausing, but the, the tricep work uh, as far as direct accessory for the bench. Okay. How heavy do you typically go when you're doing your tricep work? You, do you go to failure or do you leave some in the tank? Yeah, it depends on the, the, the workload. So like if I'm doing maximum effort on bench, like I'm, you're going to try to, the accessory work should complement the work that you're doing for, the, for your top set. So if it's a maximum effort bench, I'm going to go heavier with the triceps. But if it's a lighter work, it wouldn't make sense to do a deload bench and then max out on dips, right? Right. So it's a, it, it matches the, the work. But you know this as well. There's ways to make light exercises feel harder. Oh, Better control, you pause it, there's different ways to do it. <laughs> Give him that big laugh again, though. <laughs> Let me see how heavy that felt. Oh yeah, it's heavy. <laughs> Let's stop five reps of failure and say it's light. <laughs> Try uh, holding your arms out a little more. Out. More like so. Alright, like so. Yeah. How big are your arms? Uh, there's only one thing I measure you wouldn't be interested in. <laughs> <laughs> oh. No, I wouldn't. <laughs> you got me. <laughs> Cats, man, it's cats. It's the only thing I miss. <laughs> I gotta keep up. Well, that's one thing I got bigger than both you guys. I would, obviously, I would, I would second guess that, man. I don't know. I definitely got bigger cats hey, than you guys. It, it depends, dude. I tore my Achilles on this side. Yeah. So I got one good one, and went, they call me Biggie Smalls. So yeah. The one that, <laughs> oh, I see it now. Yeah. Yeah, I never dude, noticed it's that. A, it, this one's a inch and a half smaller now. 
Yeah, that's why when you're filming me, make sure you get it from this side only. <laughs> I can't, especially on leg day. All right, guys, we just finished up a big incline dumbbell bench day. PR for me, I think PR for you as well, right? Yeah, first time I attacked him, so that one would have been a PR. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, I actually had some experience with the 225. I did a couple weeks ago. I got three, and I got a good feel for him. This was his first time doing it. He's got four. So I'm sure like, if he came back next week, he'd probably beat me out by one rep, but we're going to have a rematch in January. That's what's up. You That's know? Right. We're going to have a rematch when we're both peaked. You know? <laughs> It's gonna be a good bit. And then Tom. 140 for eight. 140 eight PR, definitely a three rep PR, so I'm happy with that. Oh yeah. Yes, sir. More and you supplied all the hype you could ask for. So yeah. all day. <laughs> but what you got going on for the rest of the year, man? Yeah, so in my line right now, I got record breakers coming up in November. I'm gonna start training for that. Uh, I'm gonna, it's supposed to be deloading this week, actually, to start my training block. So I'm gonna push that back one week. But also getting the barbell club opened up out there. In Indianapolis, it's uh, Indy City Barbell. Hopefully, that'll coincide with the with the the, the meet. So November 11th is the day of my meet. I'm hoping to come back and open the doors to the gym right after that. So, gonna do the grand opening out there in January. Gonna have you guys come out and have Definitely. a rematch with those 225 dumbbells. Hell yeah! Looking forward to yes, it, sir. Definitely looking forward to it. What's your best numbers uh, so far in the gym? In the gym? In the gym. Let's hear it. Oh, okay. So, wait, wait, uh, all three lifts. All three. Squat, bench, Della. So, squat, uh, my best squat is 771. Uh, my best bench is 605 with a pause. And then my best deadlift is 855. Nice. Very yeah. solid. This is a grown man. This is a grown man right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah I mean, it, it's been a long road working around injuries and uh, 33 years old with a whole football career behind me. Uh, I'm just happy to still be out here lifting. Yes, sir. And what are some injuries that you managed to work around? I mean, you talking about some scar tissue in your shoulders, like you tore your pack in football. Yeah, this might be a whole separate video, actually. <laughs> how much time we got, man? I, I, I've had seven orthopedic surgeries, a lot of bumps and bruises, broken bones, stitches. It's been a long road for sure, but um, nothing debilitating, you know, nothing I couldn't come back from. And obviously, I, I'm still here, so. Nice. Yeah. There's another guy proving that. No excuses, you know? No excuses. It's definitely. Yes, sir. That about wraps up for today, guys. You know, please like, subscribe, and follow Steve at PT Fitness 500 on Instagram. Do you have a YouTube or? Uh, not yet. We're going to get that going, but you can find me there on Instagram and you can keep up to date. I'll make sure to keep you guys uh, ahead of the game. So. Do you have a Snapchat you can send you some news for? Or? Oh, come on, <laughs> man. <laughs> I don't need that kind of negativity in my life. He's a good guy. He's a good guy. <laughs> And you follow Black Tom Cruise here at Black underscore Tom underscore Cruise on Instagram. Yes. And you also got YouTube, so check it out. Definitely. And that's all for today, guys. Stay tuned for the next one.